Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Colleen Harris, and I'm the representative deputy lieutenant for Wandsworth. That means I was the Queen's representative, I'm now the King's representative. We come together this afternoon following the passing of our late sovereign, Queen Elizabeth II. Our sadness at this time is shared by people across the globe as we remember with affection and gratitude the lifetime of service given by our longest reigning monarch. But the basis on which our monarchy is built has ensured that through the centuries the crown has passed in an unbroken line of succession. Today's ceremony marks the formal proclamation to the people of the borough of Wandsworth of the beginning of our new king's reign. It is now my duty to introduce the mayor of Wandsworth, Councillor Jeremy Ambash, who will explain the significance of today's event and read the accession proclamation. Thank you very much, Deputy Lieutenant, and thank you all for coming to this historic event. It's happening here in Wandsworth, but it's also happening simultaneously all over the country at this point in time. I'm going to read the proclamation. Whereas it has pleased Almighty God to call to his mercy our late sovereign, Lady Queen Elizabeth II, of blessed and glorious memory, by whose decease the crown of the United Kingdom of Great Britain and Northern Ireland is solely and rightfully come to the Prince Charles Philip Arthur George. We therefore, the Lords Spiritual and Temporal of this realm and members of the House of Commons, together with other members of Her Late Majesty's Privy Council and representatives of the realms and territories, aldermen and citizens of London and others, do now hereby with one voice and consent of tongue and heart publish and proclaim that the Prince Charles Philip Arthur George is now, by the death of our late sovereign of happy memory, become our only lawful and rightful liege, Lord Charles III. By the grace of God of the United Kingdom and Great Britain and Northern Ireland and his other realms and territories, King, Head of the Commonwealth, Defender of the Faith, to whom we do acknowledge all faith and obedience with humble affection. Beseeching God, by whom kings and queens do reign, to bless his majesty with long and happy years to reign over us. Given at St. James's Palace this 10th day of September in the year of our Lord, 2022. God save the king. God save the king. Hip hip hurrah. Hip hip hurrah. Hip hip, 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 h